Hello and welcome back. Excuse my jank lighting setup, but I uh, wanted to make sure you could see uh, what was going on here. But I'm just going to be showing you this cool vamp that John Mayer does on Vultures. <laughs> This is from the live from Webster Hall show. This is a couple days after Continuum dropped. Really good performance. I recommend uh, you listen to it. A lot of good stuff in there. But yeah, at the very end of Vultures, he's he just starts going on this little vamp. <laughs> So what he's doing there, and I'm on the middle pickup, um, just thumb on the 14th fret of the low E here, and then I'm barring D, G, and B with my index finger, and then I've got my ring finger on the 16th fret of the B. Couple hits there, one hit on that bass note, then a couple quick staccato -y hits. Take it off. And then with our thumb, we're gonna start this run. And then we're gonna hit that next note with our index finger. And then we're just kinda of walking down that blues pentatonic. And once you get to the D, you're gonna flatten your ring finger to catch the G and the B string again. And then pull off to your index finger, which should be ready to hit the same strings. and then just keep walking it down. And then at the very end, before he finishes it, he goes up to this note. Ah. So, <laughs> I just learned it earlier, so I'm, I'm still a little rough with it, but. And I, you can use your pinky there. I think it might be more ergonomic to do that. So once you get down here, like you would, you're gonna get the D in the G string here. And then go down a fret on the A string, and that's the 15th fret. And then have your index finger kinda here, barring, you know, you don't have to get anything really other than this note but you're gonna rake up with your index finger, you know. And then your thumb kind of does the rest there. Ah. And then with your ring finger, you can slide back up on the D and B. Ah. And then hit that octave to end it. Definitely takes practice. I'm still kind of working on it, cleaning it up. Uh, it's it's harder considering how close together all the frets are up here, but uh, it's worth uh, getting the groove down. You know, it's worth uh, hammering out. So, um, if you enjoyed this and it was thorough enough, please give it a like. Um, you know, let me know your thoughts. Give me suggestions for future lessons. If there's like a you're like, oh, I like this lick you did in this performance, or even, you know, some other artist. If there's a cool lick you want to learn, just drop it. I'll check it out, and uh, I may make a video on it. So, yeah. Um, subscribe! I guess. I don't know. Peace. <laughs>